Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My concept is to learn multiple skills in one world. I will help you to learn everything. To get upcoming videos please subscribe to my channel. I will give some tasks after every video. You can show me the task in the Facebook group, link in the description. Watch my all videos it will be helpful for you. You can learn and, apply it in your career. If you learn something from my video please share it. It will be helpful for others. Watch all videos and like and subscribe for the next videos. Let's start today's video. First of all, I would like to thank those who have encouraged me, for the next video by commenting and liking my previous videos. If you encourage me like this, I hope I can share some knowledge with you. In the previous video, I discuss, retouching and painting tools, Today I will discuss about drawing and type tools and navigation tools. Pen tool. Photoshop's pen tool allows you to draw extremely precise paths, vector shapes or selections. Freeform pen tool. The freeform pen tool allows you to draw freehand paths or shapes. Anchor points are automatically added to the path as you draw. Curvature pen tool. The curvature pen tool is an easier, simplified version of the pen tool. New as of Photoshop CC 2018, Add Anchor Point Tool. Use the Add Anchor Point Tool to add additional anchor points along a path. Delete Anchor Point Tool. Click on an existing anchor point along a path with the Delete Anchor Point Tool to remove the point. Convert Point Tool. On a path. Click on a smooth anchor point with the Convert Point tool to convert it to a corner point. Click a corner point to convert it to a smooth point. Horizontal Type Tool Known simply as the Type Tool in Photoshop, use the Horizontal Type Tool to add standard type to your document. Vertical Type Tool The Vertical Type Tool adds type vertically from top to bottom. Vertical Type Mask Tool. Rather than adding editable text to your document, the Vertical Type Mask Tool creates a selection outline in the shape of vertical type. Horizontal Type Mask Tool. Like the Vertical Mask Type Tool, the Horizontal Type Mask Tool creates a selection outline in the shape of the type. However, the type is added horizontally rather than vertically. Path Selection Tool. Use the Path Selection Tool, the black arrow. In Photoshop to select and move an entire path at once. Direct Selection Tool. Use the Direct Selection Tool, the white arrow, to select and move an individual path segment, anchor point or direction handle. Rectangle Tool. The Rectangle tool draws rectangular vector shapes, paths or pixel shapes. Press and hold shift as you drag to force the shape into a perfect square. Rounded Rectangle tool. The Rounded Rectangle tool is similar to the standard rectangle tool but draws the shapes with rounded corners. Press and hold shift to draw a square with rounded corners. Ellipse tool. The Ellipse tool draws elliptical vector shapes, paths or pixel shapes. Press and hold shift as you drag to draw a perfect circle. Triangle tool. The Triangle Tool, new in Photoshop CC 2021, draws triangle shapes. Hold Shift to draw an equilateral triangle, or use the Radius option to round the corners. Polygon Tool The Polygon Tool, updated in Photoshop CC 2021, 
draws polygonal shapes with any number of sides. Use the star ratio option to turn polygons into stars. Line tool. The line tool, updated in Photoshop CC 2021, draws straight lines or arrows. Use the stroke color and wave to control the appearance of the line. Custom shape tool. Photoshop's custom shape tool lets you select and draw custom shapes. Choose from Photoshop's built-in custom shapes or create your own. Hand tool. The hand tool lets us click and drag an image around on the screen to view different areas when zoomed in. Rotate view tool. Use the rotate view tool in Photoshop to rotate the canvas so you can view and edit the image from different angles. Zoom tool. Click on the image with the zoom tool to zoom in on a specific area. Press and hold alt, win, option, Mac, and click with the zoom tool to zoom out. That's all for today. In the next video we will start with Photoshop. Topic, basic knowledge of layer and mask. Don't miss next video. Stay with Puzzle. Thanks for watching. If you like this video please press the like button, comment, and share.